Wow, I wasn't expecting oh. this. Okay, all right. Welcome back, everyone, to Chemical React. I'm your host, Fusion Form, and over there, like always, is Gorilla Fist. And today we got you episode two of the Digimon Adventures 2020. Very different from the original first season, but I'm enjoying it nonetheless. Yep. Yep. I may not know. I may not know a lot about Digimon or remember a lot about the Digimon series, but yeah, I can tell things are different. Maybe Angelmon's. Maybe we're gonna get Angelmon sooner. Maybe. You know, maybe Kari's actually going to be around in the beginning rather than, like, a later, halfway through the first like, season. Uh, yeah, yeah. Wait, I remember that part. I remember that one um, building that became good later on. Or, or what I didn't address in the first episode. Um, like, you know how Matt appeared at the end and then there's uh, uh, Taichi? Mm -hmm. And they've always had this rivalry and they've always butted heads. And I think there's going to, like, emphasize it a little bit better in the beginning to make it seem a little let it make more sense i guess all right so don't forget to like comment subscribe hit the thumbs up button if you like this episode don't forget to hit the bell notification and fusion i got my fingers up all right and three two one play by the way how they talk about the the america's military oh yeah it, it reminds me of uh the first digital movie with diaboramon Hijacking the U.S. military. <laughs> oh, they know each other. They are the best friends. Really? <laughs> except for the I, humans, well, right? Right, except for the humans. <laughs> but I gotta say, what's up to the homie, man? See, he's, I hate Matt as a character. Garumon just wanted want to say hi to fucking Greymon over there. Like, hey, you're alive. Good to see you. It's not always the case. Well, in the first season, like, all the baby Digimon are together. Uh -huh. And in, like, Digimon Next Order, the game, uh, Gabumon and Agumon are always by each other. <laughs> he's, he's, he's so shy. <laughs> can't even see you, man. Man, that's a manly deep voice right there. He Googled it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Although I'm not sure if that was intentional to him to address the, the computer guy and not the main character. Oh, yeah, it was. Okay. All right. That's a dick, even though his crest is friendship. Oh, the irony. It's not like that. It was not the part of the Digimon where like everybody had their crest, but it was like they they did the opposite up until they got to that point. Yes, yes, okay. that's yeah. that is pretty accurate. Okay, all right. And and he ends up going basically. Yeah, because I remember wasn't who was Mimi was courage, right? No, Ty's courage. I don't freaking know, man. Didn't I said know. this last episode. <laughs> I look at Kari and I think of the rabbit from B Stars. <laughs> yeah, but completely do different voice actors. In this situation, yes. Well, maybe. You think the dub has to? <laughs> I actually don't, I don't know. know. I don't know. <laughs> Better go check the dub. You know, for a Digimon kind of Greymon, right? This doesn't look pretty uh -huh. gray. That's a lot. Uh oh. Nope. <laughs> they noticed. They're on to us. Okay, that was one accurate shot. <laughs> that was a homing shot, all right? and everything. All right, I'm calling BS on that shot. Is that the queen? No, that's the rookie form. Oh. There's definitely a lot more action than the first season. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, shaking my hands at you. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, is, is, the, is the missile been shot already? Or it's about to be no, shot? No, that's the countdown to it being shot. Okay. I'm about to say, if it's been shot in the sky, there's nothing you can do about it, guys. It's funny, in the in the movie, 
Uh -huh. This is a ballistic missile, and this is a nuclear missile. <laughs> we gotta up the ante somehow. Wait, day. why are they all connected to the this this one particular rookie form? I don't End understand. Day. Let's see once again. Is it going ultimate? I, w I wouldn't doubt it. Gotta wait for the smokes to clear. This can't be another champion. That that'd be weird. Okay, the champion form lost to just Mega Flame, and the rookie got beat. Didn't get beat by two heavy attacks. Keep in mind, they gotta beat this thing within a minute, and time has already passed. <laughs> Fight within 40 seconds now. What? Oh! What? what is oh, that? so he's not his ultimate for. Well, okay. So this is like. This is an alternative ultimate form. Oh, this alternative. Um, oh, that's kind of cool. This I can get behind. This, is, this isn't the true ultimate. I like those purple teardrops that it got going on. <laughs> I hope when we finally, if that thing finally gets a mega. I uh -huh. hope it's a different mega because I don't really care for the mega form. Hmm. He's too bulky. Quit being emo. <laughs> Let him, leave him alone. He's like thirteen. That's no. like the perfect emo phase, alright? <laughs> no, I disagree. Oh, can you pause? Yeah. Keep in mind, guys. One minute timer going out for the missile to go off. Are they gonna fuse? Unless now? the logic. Wait, they're gonna fuse? No way. Not in episode two. Pretty sure someone's gonna comment or mention something, but they're gonna be like, the time in the digital world is different than the time in the real world. And that's how a minute in this. You Technically, know. it is, but. Yeah, I know. feel like it's gonna be like the hyperbolic chamber, except reversed in Dragon Ball Z. Again, like I said, this is the minute. They should have been dead by now. Grandma can jump. <laughs> That's right, bite him. That's gonna work. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I was about to say, if they, if they were to fuse now, I'd be like, it's way too early for that shit. <laughs> Just die, damn it. <laughs> it just falls. It's flopped over, burning to death. Okay. In digital flames. Oh no. They're sure making episode two interesting. Hmm. Is it is this the actual ultimate form? You got your wish. Um Oh. This is not good. Oh! Where? <laughs> wow, I wasn't expecting oh. this. Okay, alright. We shot a freaking nuke. Oh my god, it's Mega. <laughs> oh. Uh. 
Oh dear. I think they are gonna end up fusing. Hmm. But probably in episode three. Oh dear God. That's right. Type, type faster. He's like, how do you how, Google? How do you disable a nuke in the sky? Medicine, medicine. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. I didn't know it did that. <laughs> did I? Okay, now. Wait a minute. <laughs> what's up? Lev, what's up? <laughs> you seem so upset. I don't know what I am right now. Oh. Is that his? This is Omnimon, right? I, I, or I don't Mega know. Mon. Yes. Wow, I guess they will in the second episode. So skinny. Obviously, you want to talk about it. I don't know. Like, I don't know much about Digimon, but I'm gonna hear you rant about it. Let me talk about it. Okay. Okay. So. Yeah. That's Omnimon or Omegamon, everyone. That's, that's the fusion, right? That's the fusion. Um, and the original series. Spoilers for those who haven't seen the original series. Good, good job. Um, <laughs> it happens at the very end of the first season when they're fighting Myotismon, and mm -hmm. it takes Angel Woman and... Ah, so that's... That's what that's. And that's why they showed up. Yeah. To shoot them both through the chest with arrows to unlock Mega Evolution. To be yeah. able to do or, or fusion this. And that's the whole point with TK and Kari touching the feathers because that represents the wings of their angel Digimon. Mm hmm. And some reason or another that connected with them to give them the fusion ability now. Um, even though they don't have their Digimon yet. Yeah. I mean, so, it's cool, but it's really different. Alright, so I might as well just tell you what I read from the comments of this anime. But yeah, for pretty much what I understand, uh, people are saying, like, they're... I wouldn't say complaints or concerns. It's like they're, they're, they're like you know champion to mega to you know this like how you were talking exactly how you would how you reacted. But I also found out like uh, basically the first two episodes, maybe the third episode, is almost like a retelling of the Digimon movie. Yeah, the, there's so many similar. The Diaboramon, exactly. Yeah. That's exactly what's happening here. Yeah, and uh, and that's pretty much pretty much what I know. Which is which is another issue because oh god because. <laughs> The Digimon movie uh -huh. is after the events of season one, before the events of season two, or or like right in season one somewhere, mm -hmm. because um, everyone has their Digimon, everyone's back home, yeah, um, and they try to get everyone to come fight with them, because he can only they the only people who are, are fighting is. Uh, Izzy, TK, Matt, and uh, Ty, and no one else is responding, let alone know this is happening. They're all assholes. <laughs> wow. Um, but uh, everything else is pretty much the same. But um, there was I, there was obviously more ultimate levels and more ultimate fight. But this yeah. is, I mean, it, it's, it's so strange because... Diboramon mm -hmm. fed on 
internet speed and the way they beat Deboromon was by forwarding basically emails to his body to slow him down. This, and also they had very suspenseful music during that whole movie. This <laughs> has really good music, but it's nowhere near suspenseful. And he's not being fed off of, it, it doesn't even look like he's being fed off of data, let alone, you know, like internet speed. <laughs> so they're probably gonna actually, and Deborman had the ability to multiply. Um, he doesn't seem to have that ability. I don't think he does. Um, well, I mean, especially in that form. So I don't. I'm, they're probably just gonna beat him the old-fashioned way with brute force. Good old brute force. Good old brute force. Never failed me once. And, and you know, I mean, I don't hate. I don't hate what they're doing. I like what they're doing, especially because it's not the exact same story. It is a different story. Yeah. So it's interesting, but now, appreciate. but now like the events of the Boromon can't happen because this is the exact same thing that would happen here, which means because the, the, the event of the Boromon is what directly caused the second gen of Digigessence to get their Digimon. And so <laughs> if they redo second season, it's also going to be a different story unless they throw them into this story somehow, which is possible. But I'm I'm done ranting, ranting or whatever. My insight. I don't really have much to rant about. I again, episode two compared to episode one, much better. A lot more action. I'm actually enjoying it. There's some cool stuff. I think you mentioned there's an alternative, you know, evolution, which is pretty dope. I oh wish, yeah, his his. They should keep that up is... for every Digimon, which would be nice. Well, a lot of Digimon have alternative forms. His uh, his true form is he's like humanoid, and that that he's humanoid. That's what it is. But overall, I'm um, enjoying the episode 2 much better. <laughs> yeah, you? I'm looking forward to number 3. Number 3 will probably finish up this whole thing. Uh, but, and so... Oh, yeah. And right. so... You know, they, you know, in the season 1, they go to Digital World. And this mm -hmm. is a network. Which is like, again, like the movie. But I don't know how, when the Digital World is going to come into play. I hope soon, because I actually like that part. I, I, you know what? They're probably gonna tie this guy in with like, if they keep the, like the Dark Masters and Devimon and stuff, mm -hmm. they'll probably just tie. Like the reason that thing was here was because of these, these guys, or something. I just remember that villain with the cogs. <laughs> Devimon. I hope they keep that in there. That, I do like that. I like the Dark Nears. They were cool. Yeah, that was actually pretty cool. I like that. But I think that's enough talking and ranting and going on. So don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Hit the thumbs up button if you like this episode. Let us know what your favorite moment scene in the comment section was. I think my favorite scene is that that creature just flopping over, dying in flames. Digital flames, as Fusion says. <laughs> <laughs> but I do agree with you. Like, it took two shots and it should have died. But, you know. What about you, Fusion? What's your favorite scene? Uh, I, I really enjoyed it when it revealed that Argamon was now Mega instead of... Uh, doing his other ultimate form. And like always, we will see you to the next episode.